Hello, today I'm going to show you how to get custom themes and plugins for your Steam. It'll look something like this. Alright, first what you're going to want to do is open up your browser and search up steambrew.app. I'll leave a link of this in the description below. Click on install now. You're going to want to go to this one, copy it, close your browser, search up PowerShell on your computer, and run it as admin. And then just paste. Let it go through the process. All right, after that's finished, you're just going to want to launch Steam. After Steam launches, you should have it installed. You can check by clicking Steam in the top left, Settings, and you should have two new tabs, Themes and Plugins. To quickly install themes, you can click Steam in the top left, Settings, themes and click get more themes it'll open up your browser and these are all the things that you can get right now some of them are paid like this one but the one that i use is simple dark so we're going to be using that one press install let this finish after it's done if you want to get a plugin you click the plugins tab in the top right steam db extension or any plugin that you want from here and download I'll show you what to do with this after. Open up Steam. Click on Client Theme, the drop down. Click Simple Dark or whatever theme you installed. Restart now. And it's that simple to install a theme. To install a plugin, what you're going to want to do is open up your File Explorer. Go to your Steam directory. Mine is located in Program Files 86. Steam, plugins. What you're gonna wanna do is make a new folder. I'll just name it Steam DB plugins. Open up a new tab. Open up the zip that you just downloaded and just drag the files that came with it into that folder. And then close Steam. After that, reopen it. Click on the Steam in the top left, Settings, Plugins, and you can enable it here. It might restart your Steam whenever you enable it. To test if it's working, just go to any game. We'll try this one. It'll show you the lowest price that it's been at and show you different places that you can buy them. If you have any issues, I'll leave a link to the Discord in the description where you can ask for help on the support channel. Thank you for watching.